Hello, anyone and everyone, I am Echo, and today we're exploring Final Fantasy VII. Uh, today is gonna be, oh boy, a bit of an experiment. I hope this doesn't turn out bad, because uh, Final Fantasy VII, congratulations, you're the first game to force me to now try recording my audio uh, from my microphone and in-game separately, and then I'm gonna have to put them together in editing, and hopefully it won't be uh, bad. So, but considering this is the first time I've done this, it might be bad. So, just fair warning to you all. Um, right now we are here in the Sector 5 thingamajigabobber, and uh, we're gonna go try and blow it up. Biggs, we're gonna pull out now, we'll meet up at the hideout. Cloud, we're counting on you to blow up the reactor. Oh, so I have to do it entirely by myself somehow, huh? Cool. Thanks a lot, guys. But we're actually gonna go back this way because there were some other directions I didn't go in. I was kind of a, in a hurry last episode because, uh, mm, excuse me, hiccups and stuff. Hey, I missed an item. Look at that. Received a poach. Ocean. God dang. Oh, God. Please don't tell me I'm getting the hiccups. Maybe I shouldn't have drunk soda before doing this. Damn it. Anyway, I don't remember what direction I came from. I think the, I think this, because this is the vent. Right. No, 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 no. Back that way. Back the way. Come on, Cloud. Come on, Blondie. Um, no, 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 fuck, I'm keep, I keep messing it up. I'm going in the wrong direction. Oh, okay. Why is it... So it is supposed to go towards the camera. I wasn't wrong. It's just that, for some reason, the game made pressing forward go towards the camera. That's so stupid. Whatever, anyways. Um, I believe it came from up there to the right. So down here we want to check out, right? I think so. We'll see after we kill these enemies. These terrible, horrible people. With their bubble attacks. That put people to sleep, goddammit. Hey, 33 damage! That's like twice what you usually do, Tifa. Congratulations. Thanks so much. Barrett, could you wake up? Please, Barrett. Please. I don't know if I can... I, I mean, I know there's items to manually wake people up from their sleep, but... Oh, hey, cool, he woke up. I don't know how long it's supposed to normally take. Yeah, Cloud, just target the air. That'll work. That'll do it real good. Oh, uh, no, let's... Or, I didn't mean to change, I meant to defend. That's the other... Damn it. Whatever. We'll save his limit for an enemy that uh, has full health, I guess. There you go, take everything. Yeah, anyway, like I was trying to say, and like I keep messing up, uh, at the end of the last episode, I was in kind of a hurry to end it because we were already going over on our time. And so... Oh, we're right back where we started. Okay. That makes no sense. This... Th this air vent here is to the left of the ladder I just came up. Alright, yep, Braver, and use it on one of those things, because I think they have more health. Those, like... They look like, uh, seahorses. That's quite an enemy design. Anyway. Yeah, it doesn't really matter who I target, I suppose. Everything's kind of an equal threat at this point. But, uh, yeah, no, that air vent, we'll get a better look at it when we're done with this thing. It's to the left of the ladder I just came up. But this ladder, when we go down it, is to the left of that ladder over there, which is far to the right. And that ladder leads to the air vent. So, what the hell game? I th also, I think, did we come up this? I can't remember, and I don't... Can we not get back on it? I think that's a ladder right there, isn't it? Oh, it's uh, it, it's blocked off by little uh, thingies. Little signs, like the, the kind they put up next to the road during construction work. Yeah, we came up there from the top right, so alright, I guess... 
guess I figured out all the directions and stuff. So glad I wasted your time trying to look over all that. It's absolutely fantastic. And once again, Tifa really contributing to the team when both of the other two can one-hit the enemies. And she basically doesn't add anything. I suppose I should have... In that situation with those uh, weird robot things with the, like, rocket boosters for faces, I should probably have Tifa fighting one of them by herself and have her take two turns to damage one of them and each of the other two to damage the other one. Oh well, oh well. So yeah, now we're back up here. And I guess I, there, I didn't actually ignore that many directions. I thought it looked like, uh, cause, I guess because I was in a hurry, I wasn't really paying attention last time at the end of the last episode. Uh, it ended up, you know, sort of, oh, there's no point in saving. Ah, uh, yeah, there is, I guess. Whatever. Oh, why well, can't we, what? No, don't quit to windows. Okay. Have to be a little bit closer. Whoops. There you go. Save just in case I die, I guess. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Alright, let's go back up now. Up here to blow up the ra reactor completely by ourselves, somehow. Did, uh, Jolene or whatever her name is <laughs> leave us a bomb to do it with? Ooh, we're sliding! Cool! How fun. How fantastically fun and great. And oh look, it's those things. I don't know what they are. I suppose, eh, wait, does, does the game tell you the name of the enemies? Cloud, no it doesn't, it just puts the finger over them, it doesn't. Maybe there's like an a, a ability or a magicite thing or whatever I can get to have the game tell me the enemy's name. I know there's one, uh, there's an ability Yuffie has, I believe. Whoops, spoilers, there's a character named Yuffie in this game. Uh, I believe she has an ability that lets you, like, examine an enemy's stats, but I'm not sure if... I don't remember if you have to actually manually select to use that ability, or if it's just a passive thing that happens as long as you have her in your party. I don't remember. Also, let me look at the health here real quick. And Materia, not Magicite, what am I thinking? Okay. Nobody's about to die. This probably leads to the reactor. So let me see what's up these stairs first. I'm far more interested in that. And all these stupid things. Alright, you know what? Let's, let's do what I said I was going to try doing earlier. Have her spend two turns attacking one thing. So that hopefully her moves won't be a complete waste. Yeah? Sound good? Oh, dang, these guys must have a lot of defense. The other Cloud didn't do much damage to that one either. Or that might be because Cloud's... Uh, might be because that guy is in the back row, so I think he takes less damage from melee attacks or something. That's probably the problem. So, yeah, have... Bear attack the ones in the back row, I guess. Yeah, I think that's the deal. I think that's what's going on. I forgot that that actually mattered. Because, like, actually, quite a few RPGs, I think, have a, uh... What's the order like? Oh, wait. No, 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 no. That's not what I mean. Not order. Um... Limit. Config. Limit. What the... No, 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 not that. Not, not. What's the? Where's the thing for? Oh, there you go. Okay, so yeah, put him at the back, so he should take a bit less damage. And since he has a ranged attack, his his own damage won't be penalized. I think that's how it works. I don't know. It's been a really long time, and like I was trying to say, um, enemies. Or, I mean, a lot of RPGs have mechanics like that, where you can put your characters into different rows and stuff, but it doesn't usually matter. I think it might matter in this game, I'm not sure. Oh well. Oh no, Barrett, you're getting your 
ass kicked. No, no, Cloud, target that one, please. There you go. Good job, guys. You did it. You did it pretty good, I guess. Alright, let's keep going up the stairs. Let's heal up Barret. Um, how many potions do I have? 17. That's a good number. Very good number indeed. Alright, what's up here? Anything? Anything at all? I think... Isn't this... Wait a minute. Uh... I'm not sure which way I'm supposed to go. I mean, this looks really similar to the other... The other reactor we were at that we had to blow up. I think that door is the exit. Yeah, it must be, because we came down a slide to get down here. So, of course, we can't go back up the slide. It wasn't really a slide, it was a pipe. But it was the fastest way our character could think to get down. So, uh... He jumped for it. There you go. Finish that off. Can you finish it, Tifa? No. God damn it, Tifa. what I do to deserve this? At least you've got your limit break. Maybe that'll do something. Alright, let's get back down the stairs. I think, yeah, I think I'm going the right way. I think the reactor should be down here. Or more specifically, the place where we blow up the reactor. And actually, on top of this platform up here, that looks like the exhaust pipe for the reactor. So, yeah. And this does look almost identical to the first reactor we went to, number three or whatever it was. So I guess we'll be escaping out the top there. Cool. Good to know that I'm going the right way. Good to know that I'm barely able to remember this after all this time. Oh! Hey, look, it's Red 13's cousin. What? Oh, right. Hit. What? I didn't even choose a target, did I? God, Tifa, that wasn't even twice the damage of a regular attack. Should I have gone for yeah instead? There you go. Lucky crit. Good job. Uh, you know, it really makes me wonder. Like, I, I, I have no idea. I'm not one who normally pays attention to, like, the meta game of video games, but it does make me wonder if Tifa is normally picked by people. Like, is she normally considered one of the weaker characters, or stronger, or what, you know? I really have no clue. Oh, you cheeky bastards. Okay, Bear attack the one in the back. Tifa and Cloud focus on the one on the left, I guess. Oh, I think... Oh, right, because now, since they ambushed us, the position of the things has been switched. So now Cloud and Tifa are both doing less damage, because they're technically in the back row. Yeah, I guess it does matter a bit more than not at all. That's cool. And Barrett ended up doing most of the work there. Damn you, Cloud! Just because you're blonde and pretty looking doesn't mean you can get away with doing less damage than everyone else. Alright, let's, uh... Let's use some magic. Let's use some cure. And just bring everybody back up to full. And then we'll save our little butts off here. Because there's Probably a boss or something coming up. I imagine. I imagine there must be a, a boss. Or something at this point. Maybe a big fight of some kind. Oh no! A bad time to have a migraine. Oh, what's all this? Tifa. Papa! Sephiroth? Did Sephiroth do this to you? Sephiroth, Soldier, Mako Reactors, Shinra, Adjectives, Pronouns. I 
hate them all! I hate English class! <laughs> nice cowboy hat, by the way. Uh, damn, man, get a hold of yourself. You alright? Tifa. Hmm? No, forget. Come on, let's hurry. Yes, let's hurry by walking briskly over to the reactor. Okay. Not, not even briskly. Briskly actually means, like, slightly faster than really slow, doesn't it? Alright. Barrett, I'll trust you to do good work on your own. How about that? Oh, you disappointed. Alright, Tifa, you finish that one off. Cloud and Bear attack the other one, I guess. That should work. Oh, hey! Cool. Crit. Good job, Cloud. Now if you could just do that every single time. That'd be great. That'd be fantastic. Why does it, why does it make the sound of him pressing buttons? I, I suppose he was pressing buttons to set the timer for the bomb. But it could have shown him taking out a bomb. That would have made more sense. Oh well. Hey, let's uh, save, save, save again. No, let's let's no, let's not do it. Let's not just get out of here. Let's just leave. Oh, can't go out that door like last time. We did set it right. I mean, it does. It didn't. Hmm. Just make me confused now because it didn't give a timer or anything. It didn't give us a message saying we set the bomb. It's a little weird. All right, no, I guess, I think, I think we did it. I think we did it. Let's get out of here before it blows up and kills us. Even though it probably won't this time. <sighs> Just hopping over pipes. Is this, is this how the workers get down to the reactor every day? Do they have to crawl across the pipes to fix the maker reactors? Yeah, Cloud, you start attacking the ones in the back. Actually, no, or I mean, I meant to say Barrett, you attack the ones in the back, but I should have had Tifa attacking one on her own. Yeah. Because now Cloud's gonna... Oh, wait, no, actually. Cloud didn't just finish it off. Okay, maybe... Maybe Cloud needs a little bit of help with these guys, too. I suppose they're a bit stronger. How do these things move around? Like, how did they attack us of their own accord. These things don't have legs or wheels or anything to move on. I don't know. I don't know about that. Oh well. Oh well. It's a question for another day. These clearly look like in-ground sentries, but whatever. Probably just being a a dumb nerd who overthinks things, like nerds are tend to do. Oh well. Let's get out of here before we die. God damn it, another random battle? If it wasn't so much effort to edit out these, I would probably cut out some of these random battles. Honestly. What'd you do to Tifa? What? What? Why is she glowing green? Is she poisoned now? You... Damn dirty apes. What did you do? Alright, alright, now stop. Stop, just stop. Please, stop. I'm begging you, stop. Get him, Tifa. Yeah, punch that dog in the face. That weird dog experiment thing. Good job. You did it. Amazing. For a second, I thought that was a cutscene activating. <laughs> Didn't realize the camera was just switching. Alright, uh, jump up on the ladder. Come on. It's kind of weird how sometimes he'll just walk across certain ladders that are laying down at an angle, and other times I have to press the action button to make him cling on to them. Oh well. Oh well. Any bets on how many more uh, random battles we'll have to do before we get out of here? Too late, betting time over. Alright. Let's head up. Switch on. Get the hell out of here. 
Yeah. Awesome. I'll just assume we went to the right level. Hey! Treasure chest. Received an ether. An MC, M MC ether. Yeah. Ha. There you go. Pointless fucking reference to something that makes no sense. That's YouTube comedy for ya. Tons of effort put into it. Tons. Alright, you know what? You do that. And then... I think... Probably best if Tifa attacks the one on the right a second time. And she can finish it off. And then Cloud can probably finish this one off by himself right now. Yeah! Awesome! Oh, and Tifa, you could use some more health. But we're going to be escaping soon, and there's probably going to be a cutscene or something, and I think they heal your party up after cutscenes. Jesse said we all we all have to push the button at once. No good, let's try it again. Damn it! Cloud! <laughs> oh god. How am I supposed to get the timing for this correctly? Okay, one, two, three... No, okay. One, two... Damn it! One, two... There you go! Alright. Just had to mentally count it out. Had to do it the old-fashioned way. Hey, look at that! The game's letting us, letting us save again! I love you, game! I love saving, because saving means that if I die, I don't have to start back 15 minutes earlier. And it also means when I have to end the recording, I don't have to <laughs> replay through a bunch of shit. <laughs> That's the real advantage. Oh, Tifa's got her break thingy. Oh, whoops, Cloud Barrett's got his move. Yeah? What does Yeah do? Is Yeah good? No, don't attack that one, it's already damaged! Tifa! Why? Why you do this? Can you really not aim that? Or is it doing like the auto-skippy thing? Like it does with uh, test conversations. I'm not sure. I can't tell. It's really badly communicated. Oh well, let's get out of here. Oh. Indecision! This way! Uh-oh. Shinra soldiers! Shit, what the hell's going on? A trap. Pre president Shinra? Why is the president here? Hmm, so you all must be... What was it? Avalanche! And don't you forget it! So you're President Shinra, huh? Long time no see, sir. Long time no see? Oh, you. You're the one who quit Soldier and joined Avalanche. I knew you'd been exposed to Mako from the look in your eyes. Tell me, traitor, what was your name? Cloud. Forgive me for asking, but I can't be expected to remember everyone's name. Unless you become another Sephiroth. Ah, Sephiroth. He was brilliant. Perhaps too brilliant. <laughs> okay. By this point in the story, I think Sephiroth's already betrayed Shinra, hasn't he? Sephiroth? I don't know. Maybe that's spoilers. Maybe I'm forgetting things wrong. I don't know. Anyway. Don't give a damn about none of that. This place is going up with a big bang soon. Serves you all right. And such a waste of good fireworks, just to get rid of vermin like you. Vermin? That's all you could say? Vermin? Shinra the vermin for killing the planet. Guess that'd make you king vermin. So shut up, jackass. You are beginning to bore me. I'm a very busy man, so if you'll excuse me, I have a dinner I must attend. Why'd you even come down here then? Just to taunt them? Dinner? Don't give... Don't give me that. I ain't even started with you yet. But I've made arrangements for a playmate for you all. What's that noise? Probably a giant robot. The hell is that? 
Yay, look at that, it's a giant robot. I was totally right. Meet Airbuster, a techno soldier. Our weapon development department created him. Weapon development department? That's, that's so. Like, just. Oh, whatever. Whatever, I'm just. Shut up. Uh, I'm sure the data he'll extract from your dead bodies will be of great use to us in future experiments. Techno soldier? Now then, if you'll excuse me. Wait, President! Jeez, doing these voices kind of hurts my throat a little bit. Yo, Cloud, we gotta do something about him. <laughs> He's just like trying to run into them. Help, Cloud! This is from Soldier. Oh God, I can't do the Tifa voice. It's, par it's powerful. No way, it's just a machine. I don't care what it is. I'm gonna bust him up. Are we going to actually be on it on opposite sides? Yeah, cool. We're on, on opposite sides. All right, attack it. Yeah, attack it. Yeah, attack it. How much else we can do? Counterattack. Oh, no. It's attacking Barrett. And Tifa's not healed up. I should probably heal her up. I probably should have done that before getting to this point. I didn't think it was going to jump us into a cutscene right as soon as we went through the door. Oh, Cloud's got his limit break, too. Fuck you, giant robot. You're going to take a ton of damage now. Wait, is it just dead? Seriously? It took two hits and on a limit break. What? <laughs> okay, sure. Au revoir. Oh no! It's gonna blow. Let's go, Tifa. Barrett, can't you do something? Wait, did it? It didn't do the victory music, did it? It didn't! What the frick? Not a damn thing. Cloud, please don't die. You can't die. There's still so much I want to tell you. I know, Tifa. Hey, you gonna be alright? Be strong? I don't know if I can hold on. Or uh, sure, let's be a jackass, I suppose. So being strong is saying nothing? Oh, okay. You worry about yourselves. I'm all right, but take care of Tifa. All right, sorry about this. Stop talking like this is the end. Okay, hold on. Whoa! Oh my god! Yep, he's dead. Don't tell me something stupid happens like he lands on a really fragile roof and breaks through it and lands on a big pile of flowers and somehow that breaks his fall. No, he fell like two miles. He's fucking dead. You alright? Can you hear me? Yeah. Back then, I only got scraped knees. What do you mean by back? Oh, wait. Oh, that was the other person talking. Whoops. What do you mean by back then? What about now? Can you get up? What do you mean by back then? What about now? Don't worry about me. Worry about yourself now. I'll try. Oh, it moved. How about that? Take it slow now, little by little. Hello? Hello? I know. Hey, who are you? Hello? Hello? What? What? Oh my god, no. Did we seriously just do exactly what I said it was gonna do? Well, what a coincidence. Oh my god. I predicted it perfectly. And we're alive by some stupid miracle. You okay? This is a church in the Sector 5 slums. You just fell from above. You really gave me a scare. I came crashing down. The roof and the flower bed must have broken your fall. You're lucky. Flowers don't break falls. That's bullshit. They're extremely fla fragile and tiny. And stop. You cannot break someone's fall with flowers. That literally would have added nothing to it. The roof, a roof could break a fall, but not from two miles up. <sighs> you're not lucky. You're just a dumbass who doesn't know how to die. Flower bed, is this yours? Sorry about that. 
that's all right. The flowers here are quite resilient because this is a sacred place. It's built on an Indian burial ground. They say grass and flowers won't grow in Midgard, but for some reason they have no trouble blooming here because it's built on an Indian burial ground. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, that's always the thing. That's always the case. I love it here. Oh, we're free to move. Okay, yeah, nice transition from cutscene to gameplay. Okay, so we meet again. Oh, we didn't exactly meet again. We just... I didn't leave, so it's not like I left and came back. That would be appropriate to say we meet again, but no. Whatever, okay. Do you remember me? Yeah, I remember. Never saw you. What? 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 Never... Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, she's saying we meet again because we did. We passed her on the way leaving the Sector 3 reactor after we blew it up. That's right. Yeah, so I guess we do remember. Yeah, I remember. You were selling flowers. You're the slum drunk. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, boy. Hmm. I don't remember this being an option. I don't know what, what happens. So let's go with it. Excuse me, but you're really rude. I don't remember a thing. Well, that's okay. Say, do you have any materia? Yes, some. Nowadays, you can find materia anywhere. But mine is special. It's good for absolutely nothing. Wow, that sounds great. Good for nothing? I just don't know how to use it. You just don't know how to use it. Hmm. <clears throat> No, I do. It just doesn't do anything. I feel safe just having it. It was my mother's. Say, I feel like talking. Do you feel up to it? After all, here we are meeting again. I don't mind. Wait here. I've got to check my flowers. It'll just be a minute. Okay. You're just gonna run around and Check your flowers, huh? Sure. You, you do that. I'll, uh, peek around in the corners for items or something. I'm not seeing anything. Nope. Okay. Cool. Oh, what about over here? I guess I didn't actually use the action button over here. Nope, nothing. Okay. Hey, you got anything else to talk about? Oh, I... Hmm. I do kind of like that we can't actually walk through the middle of the flower bed. Because he's trying to be all courteous and not, uh, you know, kill more of them or whatever. Yeah, hey, anything else to say? Just a little longer. Oh. Now that you mention it. We don't know each other's names, do we? My name is... Eris. There we go. And let's just select the fucking... Come on, select. Thank you. I'm Eris, the flower girl. Nice to meet you. The name's Cloud. Me, I do a little bit of everything. Is that Renus? Re Reno? Eris. Oh, a jack of all trades. Yeah, I do whatever's needed. What's so funny? What are you laughing at? Sorry, I just... Psh, okay. Cloud, don't let it get to you. Seriously, who is that? It looks kind of like Reno, but why is he just showing up at the church in the middle? Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Yeah, okay. Just walking in here in a place that's clearly not in public use anymore. It's in complete disrepair. Floorboards are all torn up. Some of the, like, pews or whatever they're called, the benches that people sit on, some of them are, like, broken and on their sides and stuff. You have no reason to be here. You just showed up, coincidentally, in the middle of our conversation. All right, anything else? Say, Cloud, have you ever been a bodyguard? You can do anything, right? Yeah, that's right. Then get me out of here. Take me home. Okay, but it'll cost you. Okay, then. Let's see. How about if I go out with you once? Hmm... I don't know who you are, but... 
You don't know me. I know you. Oh yeah, I know you. That uniform. Yep, it is, it's totally. Hey sis, this one's a little weird. Shut up, Shinra spy. Reno, want me to t want him taken out? I haven't decided yet. Hmm. I might have to think up a better voice for Reno. He's like pretty much the best character in the game, you know, so I think he deserves it. Don't fight here, you'll ruin the flowers. And oh, we're just running away? The exit is back here. Back there, whatever, yeah. I guess we're just running away. Okay, sure. Sure thing. Oh no, he stepped right over the flowers. What an asshole. They were Mako eyes. Yeah, alright. Come on, get to work. Oh. And don't step on the flowers. Like I just kind of did. You just stepped on the image of the ruins. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Reno don't gotta listen to that shit. You don't gotta do what you, you, you plebs do. Oh, wait, wait. Are we supposed to go up or down? I think we're supposed to go up. So let's go down first. If we can. If it'll let us. I don't think it's gonna let us, actually. I'm trying to interact with the... Can't go back there. Huh. Interesting. Can we fall down here? Kind of a... Oh, oh, oh no... Is it going to be just soldiers? No, it's weird things. Okay. Oh, Eris doesn't have a very good attack, does she? Probably not. It's probably going to be even worse than Tifa's. Because she's mostly a healer. Yeah, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This isn't going to be great. <laughs> not great at all. Okay, Cloud. It, we're, we're basically doing single player for a while. We're carrying the team by ourselves. Okay, well, three hits. She was able to kill it. So I guess spacing out the attacks between her and Cloud worked. Okay, we can't... Yeah, no, we can't jump down there. Okay, that's weird. And it's not letting me interact with the ladder. Interesting. Alright, I guess we're just going up. I hope I'm not just completely remembering how to do that incorrectly or something. Oh well. Alright, let's do the same thing we just did. Harris, you focus on that one, while Cloud takes care of the other two, I suppose. Hopefully, this'll work out pretty good. Oh, don't you dodge my attacks, you piece of crap. And don't you use fire magic, that's cheating. We don't have magic. Oh, well, she might. I don't know. I haven't checked. Yeah, wow. <laughs> she actually... Ironically, she killed one sooner than Cloud did. Okay. Oh, well. I should check her, uh, Materia, though. Probably should. Probably, definitely should. Yeah. Uh... Hey, Materia... Guard stick. Check. Oh, she doesn't actually have any. She's got lightning and ice? Oh, no, those are the two that I had. Oh, so her... The materia she mentions in the cutscene isn't actually usable. Cool. There they are over there. Uh-oh. Cloud. That one. I know. Looks like they aren't going to let us go. What should we do? Well, we can't let them catch us, can we? There's only one thing left to do. Jump exceedingly far. Eris, this way. <laughs> Come on, just do it. You're a video game character. You can jump. Haven't you seen Mario? All right, I'll hold them off. Right, make sure they don't get in. in don't go, don't get through. The ancient is getting away. Blah blah blah. Eris, ah! Oh, Eris. Think we killed them? They never should have fought us. Oh, wait, no, I was accidentally doing Cloud's voice. Damn it. Cloud, help! Damn. What's that? Hold on a minute, fight him. Run! 
Come on, Eris. Oh, all right. I think... What do we want to do? We want to knock down these? Here's a barrel. If I can just push it over... Okay. Come on. Just stop! 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 Just run! Try to... Just freaking... Run! Woman! Oh, all right. Go up the ladder! It's right there! The Ancient, we got her! Great, I'm trying to... I don't remember how to push over the barrel. I'm using the action button on it. What else am I supposed to do? I probably should have given her some magic. I probably should have given the lightning or ice uh, stuff to her. Because now this is going to be a really... This isn't going to be a fun fight. Oh, they barely do any damage, though, with their melee attack. So you can just totally kill them yourself, Eris. What the hell? You just kill them in two hits and they do three damage to you. You don't have to run at all. Phew, that surprised me. Okay, so how do I knock it over then? Do I have to be on the other side? No, no, no. Just, just go over that way. Thank you. Cloud, help! Run! Oh, all right. Just push it over then, you fucking idiot! I'm using the action button. Holy crap. I'm clearly missing something, but I don't know what it is, because there's only one action button for interacting. Literally. Like... Oh my god, this game. I swear, sometimes it's just... It gives me agina. At least those ones are in the front row, so he's able to do full damage. Thank God. Alright. What about if I, like... Eris, this way. Yeah, just keep running, and I guess I don't even have to worry about the barrels. That's... Oh, God. Come on. Where we go? Oh, wait. We probably gotta go up here, don't we? Or, uh, back this way. He up here. Yep. There we go. Come on, Eris. I'll hope she just automatically follows me. Wow, it's a lot smaller looking on the outside. Ha, ha, they're looking for me again. You mean it's not the first time they've been after you? No, they're the Turks. Hmm. The Turks are a Shinra, Shinra organization. They scout for possible candidates for soldier. This violently? I thought they were kidnapping someone. They're also involved in a lot of other dirty stuff on the side. Spying, murder, you know. They look like it. But, why are they after you? There must be a reason, right? No, not really. I think they believe I have what it takes to be a soldier. Maybe you do. You want to join? I don't know, but I don't want to get caught by those people. Then let's go. Let's go and find a save point, because this episode's gone way longer than it's supposed to have. <laughs> <coughs> 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 I'm at, oh god, my throat's seriously getting fucked up by this too. Wait! Wait, I said! I can't jump as fast as you! I'm wearing a really long skirt. It's down around my ankles, like seriously, and not not cut out for this. Puff and wheeze. Slow, down, don't leave me. Funny. I thought you were cut out to be a soldier. Oh, you're terrible! Ah, ha, 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 so I'll just laugh about it really awkwardly. Hey, Cloud, were you ever in Soldier? I used to be. How'd you guess? Your eyes, they have a strange glow. That's the sign of those who have been infused with Mako. A mark of Soldier. But how did you know about that? Oh, nothing. Nothing? Right, nothing. Come on, let's go, bodyguard. Okay, cool. I, that's that's cool. I'm fine with being your bodyguard, I suppose. As long as you pay me. Alright, cool. Ju yup, jump down a little bit faster. Cool, okay. Woo, finally made it off. Now what? My house is over here. Hurry before they come. Yeah, we wouldn't want them to catch us. Oh, look at that, it's a save point, save access, and all that stuff. So, hey, time to end the episode here. I hope you all have enjoyed it. I hope you all continue to enjoy it. I'll see you all next time.
Bye bye.